Well, with 2022 being a shambling corpse at this point, we might as well do a post-mortem on the past year. I'm your host, Andrew, and this is Crypto Espresso, and instead of delivering the most cutting-edge news of crypto, we'll be taking a look back at the biggest stories of 2022 until the new year. Well, today's episode is gonna be a toughie, since we're gonna be examining the biggest bummers of the past year. Before we get started on today's list, though, be sure to ask Alex in that description below about the CMC50. We want our community to tell us the 50 biggest crypto news stories of 2022, so make sure you check out the link and vote like you've never voted before. Obviously, the bankruptcies of FTX, Celsius Network, and Voyager Digital top the list of the worst crypto stories of 2022, not to mention Terra's demise and the implosion of Bitcoin's price. But unfortunately, there were plenty of other gloomy developments that CoinMarketCap Alexandria covered this year, and we're about to find them all out. One, Virgil Griffith goes to jail. The former Ethereum developer had attended a crypto conference in North Korea, and now he's been sentenced to 63 months behind bars. It was claimed that he had given presentations that showed how digital assets could be used to avoid sanctions and launder money. Two. Tesla sells 75% of its Bitcoin. Confronted with concerns over the electric vehicle manufacturer's liquidity, Elon Musk got rid of the company's Bitcoin at a pretty hefty loss. The billionaire stressed that the transaction shouldn't be regarded as a verdict on Bitcoin, but try telling that to crypto Twitter. Three, huge job cuts and rescinded job offers. Coinbase had been bragging about plans to hire 2,000 new workers in 2022, but just four months later, it had cut 1,100 jobs and rescinded pending job offers for new hires. One man had turned down offers from Amazon and Oracle and was now in danger of losing his rights to remain in the U.S. 4. India imposes some brutal taxes on crypto. After spending years flirting with a ban, the government instead took a different approach, a 30% tax on all profits derived from trading cryptocurrencies. And to make matters worse, every single transaction would incur a 1% levy. Demand plummeted, and all of this came as tests on a digital rupee continued. 5. Twitter descends into chaos with Elon Musk at the helm. There was a fiasco as Twitter blue subscribers imitated major companies, previously banned accounts were reinstated, thousands of people were laid off, and controversial new rules were imposed. As of now, most of Musk's followers have voted for him to step down as CEO. 6. El Salvador's Bitcoin bet falters. Ambitious plans for volcano bonds and a Bitcoin city have been shelved because of the bear market, and Nayib Bukele's investment is tens of millions of dollars in the red. The president, though, is determined to keep on hodling, but this year's events may make other countries think twice about adopting Bitcoin. 7. Heartbreaking Crimes Pig butchering scams ran rampant online, with some people losing everything. Countless others were drawn into investment schemes offering returns that were just too good to be true. One man who pumped $24,000 into a Bitcoin scam was then told that his balance had dwindled to $23.16. 8. Poor Taste NFT Collections Over in Britain, the Queen passed at the age of 96, plunging the country into a period of national mourning. That didn't stop opportunists in the crypto space from launching altcoins and poor quality NFT collections in an attempt to capitalize on the sad news. 9. Crypto Influencers Face Scrutiny Leaked spreadsheets show just how much some YouTubers charge for promotions in their videos, potentially undermining the relationship they have with viewers. Others had difficult questions to answer after endorsing doomed businesses like FTX, Voyager, and Celsius. And 10, a very uncertain 2023. This year is ending on something of a cliffhanger, with many unanswered questions as the new year begins. Will Bitcoin fall lower? Is the crypto contagion going to spread? Will businesses currently teetering on the edge of bankruptcy recover? And what does this all mean for customers? While 2023 looks very uncertain, one thing, and one thing alone is, that is, you should definitely like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and click on that little bell icon to get buzzed whenever a new Crypto Espresso video goes live. I'm sorry, I just had to take that opportunity to segue. Again, I've been your host, Andrew, and Crypto Espresso will be back tomorrow for one last episode for 2022. I promise, though, we'll try to end the year on an up note. See you then.